Thank you for tuning in. Hope you're safe and well. I'm Woodsy. If you're new here, thank you for tuning in. If you've been here before, thank you for supporting. I don't often say this, um, but if you want to follow me on my Instagram and stuff like that, I will dot them about or put the link down below. But let's get into this great Nike SB Dunk. It's the Skate Like a Girl. So, Skate Like a Girl, uh, a non-profit organisation established in the early 2000s, and it's been picked up by Nike SB to do a collaboration, and this they have produced this beautiful Dunk Low. Now, Nike SB have been um, doing collaborations with uh, these communities and organisations recently, and it's really nice because, especially like Skate Like a Girl, it's a community to sort of promote the fact that everyone can skate and uh, come together and grow as a person in the skateboarding community. So it's really cool that they've picked up uh, Skate Like a Girl for this collaboration and as I said, they've done a really good job. So let's have a little look at it. Starting off with a box. So we've got a striped box. We've had quite a few striped boxed releases this year, which must mean we've had some good dunks and we have indeed. Uh, the label states Nike SB Dunk Low Quick Strike Dark Beetroot Crimson. This is a uh, UK 9.5, which is a US 10.5. So I've gone with my normal um, SB Dunk sizing, and I feel like even with this thinner tongue, it fits perfectly. To the shoe itself. Now, there's a lot of nice materials used on this, and a lot of nice detailing, and it all blends well together. Starting off, we got this gum bottom of the sole, uh, a beetroot Nike SB shield in the middle of that, white midsole, white stitching, and then you've got a majority suede upper. So you've got these beetroot panels contrasting against these really nice cream panels. Uh, the suede itself is a very sort of, a bit more of a rougher texture. It obviously has a nice build and um, strength to it and should hopefully work well against being smashed against grip tape. The swooshes are in that crimson colour and they have this em these embossed lines in it to almost give it that sort of like cool dry look. And I think that the swooshes look really nice on the this pair and I think that the crimson actually does go well. Um, to the back, so on the heel tab you've got crimson uh, stitching with that Nike in this sort of like almost like squiggly spooky writing which I think is a really nice font used. And then a really, really, really nice detail that goes well obviously with the values and uh, goes well with uh, Skate Like a Girl is the hands together showing community, showing being supportive of everyone and it's, a, it's just the actual detailing on it is really great. Um, my favourite part of the shoe is the Cauldroy sock liner and again the build and the quality of this shoe is really nice even the uh, cool droid goes all the way to the front of the shoe it's in that beetroot color and i think the last pair that i had that had that sort of cool droid sort of um, sock liner was the sting waters but that was like a white and it did get dirty quick to the tongue so the tongue is probably the thing that i that I wasn't that sure on. I, I'm not saying I'm biased against slim tongues in SB Dunks, but I do prefer obviously the puffy padded tongues. Um, what I wasn't so keen on is the fact that you have this exposed foam like a blazer tongue. Um, when it comes to blazer tongues, I actually prefer it when they don't have that exposed foam, but it actually works really well on this pair and it's a little bit different and it just makes it more uh, unique as well to have that exposed foam. So I'm not mad at it. And I think the fact that they've used a really nice um, pliable soft cool droid as well on each side really helps with the comfort and the look as well. So at the back of that tongue, it's beetroot cool droid. And as I said, it's really soft and supple and really nice against the foot. And at the front, it's a cream cool droid. Uh, you've got a beetroot tongue tag stating skate like a girl. And then on the back, it states creating an exclusive community through skateboarding since 2000. And then it's got at skate like a girl. The laces that come stock are beetroot as well, and they actually match really well with the beetroot panel. Sometimes when you have the laces, they sort of are a little bit of a different color to the actual panels that it's supposed to sort of like connect with. Uh, but with this pair, it works really well, and they've got nice detailing on these as well because it's got the skate like a girl on the tips. The spare laces are 
almost like a rope lace and if you look at the apparel they are released with Nike SB to go alongside these dunks um, it looks basically like the pull strings on the hoodie that they released. Um, crimson on the tips and also got skate like a girl. Going to the uh, apparel it was a really nice set of um, releases they did a hoodie a crew neck and I think a few t-shirts I'll hopefully dot around the pictures the hoodie was really nice it was a cream hoodie had skate like a girl on the front and then actually when you lifted it up at the bottom underneath the um, pockets it had skate like a girl stitched in in black which is a nice hidden detail and the fact that all the long sleeve um, pieces of clothing they released had the graphic that is actually on the insole I will get onto the insole in a minute but to the laces again, so the spare laces are, like, like I said, a pull string from the hoodie. They do look okay in the shoe itself, but they're really awkward to lace. They sort of bunch up and twist and go fat and thin in certain areas. And they take a bit of time to look really presentable in the shoe itself. But once you've got them down, they do look all right, but I definitely prefer the beetroot stock laces. To the insoles. So as I said, on the, the apparel that was uh, released with this launch, it had this graphic on the sleeves and it was really subtle detail and I really like it. Hopefully I would have dotted pictures around. And on the insole, it's what makes Nike SB great. I've spoken about this before. When they do a good collaboration, majority of the time they like to do a nice graphic inside and I think it is what makes uh, an SB Dunk great a lot of the time. On this pair, it actually the image joins together when you put the left and right insole together and it's just showing that whole community spirit of everyone skating and uh, showing support and hugging and stuff like that. And then you've got Skate Like a Girl on both the left and right. And it is just a lovely touch to this absolutely superb pair. Um, I really like this pair because of the color scheme, uh, the details and the, the material used all around. They're really, really nice on feet and I'm so happy I managed to pick them up. I hit with Flat Spot, so thank you Flat Spot. Great service as always, deli delivered with DPD, and yeah, brilliant pair. So I will leave all the details to Skate Like A Girl's website, Instagram, check them out. They're a non-profit organization, but they do accept donations because of the work they do towards the community. And yeah, I'm gonna do the laces and the, the, put these on and see what you think. I think they're absolutely superb. But yeah, thank you for watching. Appreciate it as always. And yeah, it's Woodsy out.